don't know. <clears throat> Maybe it's an interesting thought. I was thinking, when I wrote the book, I was thinking about the prosecutor that really tried to, to catch Alan Carson for, for murder or the... What do the courts say? If you're 100 years old, do, uh, you sentence them to lifetime or what? <laughs> and and um, I guess he's kind of right when he, he, he thinks that since I'm on overtime, when it comes to age, I can do whatever I want. Oh, I've been thinking a lot about that. I, I don't know. I was so afraid before coming to France that uh, you wouldn't understand the humor in my book. And, and, and you did. So obviously it's French humor as well. So I, I think that I represent Jonas Jonasson humor. You should sense our climate, then you would understand. I think the record last winter was 44.8 degrees minus. <laughs> what can you do but laugh about it? <laughs> oh, I'm so, I'm so happy that I waited because I always considered myself being being an author from the age of 18 or or something like that, and I had the skill technically, but. If I had had the time to finish my book when I was, let's say, 23, 24 years old, I would have stared at, you know, Milan Kundera or Garcia Marquez or Vargas Llosa and a mixture of everything, and for sure it wouldn't have been me. Uh, instead, I started when I was 47, and I had all the experience and the self-confidence to write the exactly the book I, I wanted to, to read myself. I worked as a journalist for many years and then I, I uh, started a media consultant company and we grow from two people to 100 in a few years and uh, everything went very fast uh, until it was too fast and, and um, I, I became sick actually and we sold the company and finally I was at the, at the age, finally I was ready to, to change my life, to, to become the author I was all the time. Uh, the reason why I started with this story, the 100-year-old man, uh, was partly because of the, the, the title. In, the, the Swedish title is different from the French title. It is something like the 100-year-old man who climbed out through the window and disappeared, or something like that. Very long title. And when I once I invented the title, I, I be, became so curious myself. <laughs> so, so first of all, I, I had to write the story. Ah, you could say that. The, 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 I have a working title on the second book: the analphabet who knew how to count. <laughs> <laughs> 